Hi all, welcome, welcome. Here we go. So yet another video on the Sinclair C5s and specifically my latest purchase, Ultramax lithium ion phosphate batteries, Life PA4, 36 amp, 12 volts. Absolutely amazing. So I finally pulled the trigger. So all the guys um, who modify Sinclair C5s always recommend these this particular brand and either this version in 12 volts or 24 volts or you can even get the bigger one, you know, 40 amps or greater, but 36 amps for me is the, is the correct size, the same size as the, these batteries here with the old lead acids. Now, those, I've got those, the reason I've got those, yeah, is because running two of these in a modified Sinclair C5 or just on a cruise, these make the Sinclair C5 so heavy. I checked it on the, on the, way, on the way and scales of my house, four kilograms versus just over 11 kilograms for these. So that is a massive saving of about, well, clearly that's like one third, pretty much, pretty much one third of the weight. No lie, that is light. That is heavy. It feels solid, solid. So I'm really, really pleased with that. Now, all of those are Monday and they literally arrived on Tuesday. Absolutely superb. Um, this one here is the Chaz uh, Twin Motor Sinclair C5. So I can run one battery, but realistically I would run two batteries because I've got two motors, two power systems in there and two batteries. When you run these batteries, it makes the whole C5 so, so heavy. So it works really well, but really, really heavy. That's why I wanted these. Um, flick over here. This one is the, the big dog, the 24 volt Sinclair, the fast one. This is one here that um, astronaut Sir Tim Peake um, rode on television. And yeah, that's now 24 volts. Again, running two, AGM, two heavy lead acid AGMs in there. It makes the whole thing super, super heavy. Tops out about 23, 24 miles per hour. With these, I should get an extra mile per hour because of that additional sort of lightweight aspect and how efficient they are, etc. Now, all those on Monday, like I mentioned, they arrived on Tuesday. Absolutely lovely. Got them off eBay. There's had some sort of special deal on there of saving a bit of money. So that's absolutely great news. Good thing about these, because it's the weight for a start. It's also the excellent recharging and performance on them low internal resistance and high efficiencies. So you have different sort of chemical um, compilation that you do have in these, and that's what makes these so good. And again, these this type of battery here is also the safest battery type on the market. Um, so it is the one to go for. Um, they also have inside a BMS. So I believe that all lithium batteries have a BMS inside, which is the battery management system. And that stops the battery from being overcharged or over discharged. Um, it can also cause them, the battery to cut out if you draw too much current. So that's the reason why the people with the Sinclair C5s have been using these for years, because these Sinclair C5s draw a lot of power from the motor. Certainly if you crank them on the fast ones, or you're going up a hill, for example, it's drawing a lot of current you know, at a slow speed. That's why you need a good battery, such as this one here, which um, has an excellent BMS system in it, which means it won't cut out. So that's something to consider when you, if, if people are considering buying a cheap one. You might look at the price of these and think, oh, I can get a cheap one from AliExpress or whatever. But chances are it might have a bad, a different BMS level in it and it'll cut out when you're using it, which is no good. Because at the end of the day, you know, it's so important. The motor and the battery, that, this, this is the sort of the, the lifeblood of a Sinclair C5. So it's important to go for quality and you want it to be safe as well. Anyway, that's my sales pitch over for them. <laughs> now, what I've done with these is um like i said they arrived really really swiftly um they come normally just with two uh, bolts in there and the m6s so i ordered a ordered um obviously two pairs of these brass terminals and um, these were just under 15 quid on ebay arriving in a couple of days point to note is that the positive is slightly larger than the negative so just be aware of that when you're connecting on you can also use um cables and anderson connectors i mean you want a good connection but for all my sinclair c5s all of them I use these plus anyone I work on um, I would generally speaking always fit quick release connectors which means obviously it means I can then use these batteries for testing all of my Sinclairs and anyone's Sinclairs who might come to me because I'm planning on basically getting rid of these two batteries which are really good um, with a Sinclair C5 that I'll be selling shortly um, so I won't, these literally won't be around so I'll just be using these these beauties here instead so yeah you'll need them um, connections either those or some cables with an anderson connector whatever method you want to go for now one negative i would say about this whole scenario was the battery charger so when you purchase these um, they come with a battery charger each and obviously i appreciate the fact that it comes with a free battery charger definitely it's a three amp one which is absolutely fine it's 36 amps you know, that, that does three amps per hour so you can work out the maths on that one 10 or 11 hours 
Um, cro crocodile clips on it as well. But my issue with that, with those, is they don't have an LED on them to tell you when it's charged or when it's charging. Um, that's one thing I do not like. So I just I emailed um, Ultramax, amazing client service, le absolutely legendary. They replied to me straight away and said, Paul, we'll just send you out a couple of chargers here, which are upgraded ones, which are the five amp ones, which have an LED notification on them just there. And an envelope, a return envelope to send back the old ones here, which again are, 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 are unused. So thank you, Ultramax. Really appreciate you for doing that. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, just connect these beauties up. Put the uh, back wheel in the air. So obviously they installed absolutely perfectly in there. Connections went on absolutely perfect. On here, I've got my um, uh, special battery meter. Now, I've got a subtle sticker there I just put on there just for the moment, that's all. But I will be, of course, removing that. Now, I've, now I know everything works, that's all. That was just a little act as a reminder for me, that's all, to not uh, do anything incorrect, you know, with this particular battery meter. But now I've got my lithiums, I'm very, very happy. Now, lovely, lovely. So I've got the ignition switched on. Um, and actually, let me show you, actually, if I switch it off on there, cut it off, if I put it on. Cycles just to sort of uh, show the um, power of how much juice is left. This one is specifically for lithium batteries, 24 volts. Which bear in mind, these batteries are uh, added in series to make 24 volts. Turn on the ignition. And here we go. Absolutely beautiful. Turn off the ignition, turn off those safety cutouts, and that's it. Job done. Wow, love it, love it. If I remove that quickly out of the way, check the weight. So much lighter as expected. You know, we're talking um, roughly eight kilograms versus a solid sort of 22 kilograms. So, right then, so yeah, ignition on. Fans are on on the back. Okay. Yep, here we go. Excellent. Right then, so that's a dirt with one hand, right hand. So this one has got a twist grip throttle on. Feels really, really good. I need to be careful, obviously, because um, can't be gunning it one-handed, one brake, one hand on the steering. You know, I'm gonna turn it around here. need like a selfie stick or something but uh can't really give it full throttle but yeah it feels good. excellent excellent stuff indeed lovely 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 and I say that all the lights are on there cool loving it thank you Ultramax amazing yeah excellent yeah, the power definitely felt better on the um, on the lithiums. Obviously, of course, they are brand new as well, um, but they felt yeah felt so much better. Obviously, only time will tell how great they're going to be in terms of wanting to do long distance. 
and all that. But yeah, delivery felt good. Obviously no issues with cutting out. Felt felt very, very, very nice. And I say it's just just main thing is it's just so much lighter and they're and they're extremely safe. So that now is a lot better as before it weighed a ton to, to lift it up. So yeah, you think down from 22 kilograms roughly down to eight kilograms on the battery weight, top notch. So yeah, thank you all for watching and thank you Ultramax for sending me out those upgraded chargers. Much appreciated. All the best. Cheers.